The Evolution of the Palestinian Statehood Quest Actors, Contributions, and Challenges Introduction The quest for Palestinian statehood has been a central issue in the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, marked by decades of struggle, negotiation, and violence. We examine the roles and contributions of various actors, including the Palestine Liberation Organization, PLO, Yasser Arafat, Gamal Abdel Nasser, Anwar Sadat, and King Hussein of Jordan, in the delayed establishment of a Palestinian state. It also explores the positive and negative impacts of their actions on the plight of the Palestinian people. The delayed establishment of a Palestinian state the establishment of a Palestinian state after the creation of Israel in 1948 was delayed for several reasons, including 1. Territorial disputes. The Arab-Israeli wars of 1948, 1967, and 1973 left the Palestinian territories under Israeli control, leading to displacement and territorial disputes. 2. Lack of consensus. Regional and international stakeholders had differing views on how to resolve the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, leading to political deadlock and prolonged negotiations. 3. Armed resistance. Palestinian factions, including the PLO, initially pursued armed resistance against Israel, contributing to tensions and violence in the region. 4. Regional dynamics. The involvement of neighboring Arab states, such as Egypt and Jordan, further complicated efforts to establish a Palestinian state due to their own geopolitical interests and conflicts with Israel. Negative Role of the PLO The PLO, founded in 1964, played a significant role in the delayed establishment of a Palestinian state due to both its positive and negative contributions. 1. Positive Contributions International Recognition the PLO represented the Palestinian cause on the international stage, garnering recognition and support for Palestinian statehood. Diplomatic Efforts Despite its initial rejectionist stance, the PLO engaged in diplomatic efforts, leading to the recognition of Palestinian rights and the eventual acceptance of a two-state solution. 2. Negative Contributions Terrorism the PLO, under Yasser Arafat's leadership, resorted to terrorism and violence against Israeli civilians, undermining efforts to achieve a peaceful resolution to the conflict. Internal divisions. Factionalism within the PLO, exemplified by power struggles and conflicts between different Palestinian factions, hindered unity and coordination in the pursuit of statehood. Role of Yasser Arafat. Yasser Arafat as the leader of the PLO, played a complex role in the plight of the Palestinians. 1. Positive Contributions International Recognition Arafat's leadership elevated the Palestinian cause onto the global stage, securing recognition and support from numerous countries and international organizations. Oslo Accords Arafat's engagement in the Oslo peace process led to the signing of the Oslo Accords in 1993, which established the framework for Palestinian self-governance and paved the way for the eventual establishment of the Palestinian Authority. 2. Negative Contributions Terrorism Arafat's leadership was marred by his involvement in and tolerance of terrorist activities against Israel, including suicide bombings and attacks targeting civilians. Corruption. Arafat's regime was plagued by allegations of corruption and mismanagement, undermining the effectiveness and legitimacy of the Palestinian leadership. Roles of Gamal Abdel Nasser, Anwar Sadat, and King Hussein. Gamal Abdel Nasser, Anwar Sadat, and King Hussein of Jordan also influenced the Palestinian statehood quest. 1. Nasser's Role. Support for Palestinian resistance. Nasser provided military and political support to Palestinian resistance movements, fueling tensions with Israel and exacerbating the conflict. Arab unity. Nasser's vision of Arab unity and pan Arabism shaped regional dynamics, 
and influenced Palestinian nationalist aspirations. 2. Sadat's Role Peace with Israel Sadat's decision to pursue peace with Israel, culminating in the Camp David Accords and the Egypt-Israel Peace Treaty, shifted the regional balance of power and marginalized the Palestinian cause. Isolation of Palestinians Sadat's peace overtures with Israel isolated the Palestinians and weakened their bargaining position in negotiations. 3. King Hussein's Role Jordanian-Israeli Conflict King Hussein's involvement in the Arab-Israeli conflicts, particularly the Six-Day War of 1967, resulted in the loss of the West Bank to Israel, further complicating efforts to establish a Palestinian state. Black September Jordan's suppression of Palestinian factions during the Black September conflict in 1970 strained relations with the Palestinians and deepened divisions within the Arab world. The delayed establishment of a Palestinian state after 40 years of Israel's existence can be attributed to a myriad of factors, including territorial disputes, lack of consensus among stakeholders, armed resistance, and regional dynamics. The negative role of the PLO, characterized by terrorism, internal divisions, and corruption, further exacerbated the plight of the Palestinians. Additionally, the actions of Yasser Arafat, Gamal Abdel Nasser, Anwar Sadat, and King Hussein influenced the trajectory of the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, shaping both positive and negative outcomes for Palestinian statehood aspirations. The corruption within the PLO and Yasser Arafat's reign. Corruption within political entities often undermines their legitimacy and effectiveness, and the Palestine Liberation Organization, PLO, under the leadership of Yasser Arafat, was no exception. This video delves into the pervasive corruption that plagued the PLO and the reign of Yasser Arafat, exploring its causes, manifestations, and consequences. Corruption within the PLO. 1. Financial Mismanagement A. Lack of Accountability The PLO operated without transparent financial mechanisms, allowing for embezzlement and misuse of funds. International aid intended for the Palestinian people was siphoned off by PLO officials for personal enrichment and political purposes. 2. Nepotism and Cronyism Arafat and his inner circle favored loyalists and family members, appointing them to key positions within the PLO and its affiliated institutions. Qualified individuals were overlooked in favor of those with personal connections, undermining organizational efficiency and effectiveness. 3. Lack of Institutional Oversight Weak Regulatory Framework the absence of independent oversight bodies allowed corruption to flourish unchecked within the PLO. Culture of impunity. PLO leaders enjoyed immunity from prosecution, shielding them from accountability for their corrupt practices. Yasser Arafat's complicity. 1. Personal enrichment. A. Offshore accounts. Arafat and his inner circle amassed personal wealth through the establishment of offshore bank accounts and shell companies luxurious lifestyle. Despite the impoverished conditions of many Palestinians, Arafat lived a lavish lifestyle with reports of extravagant spending on residences, cars, and travel. 2. Consolidation of Power Authoritarian Leadership Arafat centralized power within the PLO, eliminating dissent and opposition while consolidating control over key institutions. Suppression of dissent. Critics of Arafat's regime was silenced through intimidation, censorship, and in some cases, violence. 3. Impact on Palestinian society. Economic deprivation. The diversion of funds and resources into the pockets of PLO officials contributed to the economic stagnation and impoverishment of the Palestinian people. Erosion of trust. Corruption within the PLO eroded public trust in the leadership and institutions responsible for representing Palestinian interests. 